Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspies, CaseBreaks.com, coming at you with 2022-23 Panini Prism Basketball Fast Break Edition, 10 box, pick your team number one. This is also a wax party break. So at the end, we'll re-randomize everybody's names and uh, we'll give away yet another wax party invite. Big thanks to this group for making it happen. Last day of the month, 31st. Thanks everybody for getting in, we appreciate you. Nancy with Last Bob Mojo. We did this straight up, no filler, which I always appreciate. It's always nice. All right, now, this is a fresh case. Did I get the right case? Yes, fast break. Um, second half is in the store. It's kind of heavy. Second half is in the store if you want to run this back at some point tonight. Let's finish uh, the month of May on a strong note, boys and girls. We've had a pretty strong month. I haven't, I haven't looked at the numbers, but it's, it's been feeling good. Empty box. Okay, so we've got it's a half case break. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so we got ten boxes on the left side and 10 boxes on the right side right here. One, two, three for the left side, four, five, six for the right side. It's one. You're gonna have to trust me on that. It's just off the camera, but uh, let's, I think, I think this is the only one we have. So why don't I just set these aside over here and we'll save those for, for next time. Set that right there. All right, good luck everybody. So fast break. What are we looking for here? One autograph, a bunch of prism parallels. All right, so we're looking for some of those box exclusives, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. So thanks everyone for, for joining. Now this break is gonna take a little bit, sort of a sneaky long break, but we'll get this done. But in the meantime, um, visit jazbeescasebreaks.com if you wanna, if you'd like. Do me the favor and uh, get some spots. Let's get something else going. Well, since this is a basketball break, let's start off with a basketball conversation here. Heat at Nuggets, game one. Starts tomorrow. Who does everyone have? I think the Nuggets are the favorites. We'll be watching that game together uh, tomorrow on ABC, 5.30 LA time, 8.30 East Coast time. Is that a little late for East Coasters? According to ESPN's matchup predictor, they're giving Denver a 78% chance at winning. They're only giving Miami 22%. I think Tyler Hero, is he still out? I think he still might be out. And the Nuggets are minus nine. Minus 400 on the money line. That makes me think, I don't know, I don't, I don't do very well on, on uh, basketball plays, but. I put a little, little coffee money on the, uh, on the heat money line maybe. Do all card chip in this? Yeah, all card chip in this as well. Nice. All right, thanks everybody. Here we go. The Draymond. Four out of twenty. Four twenty. That's for the Warriors, that's for Fong. Jabari Smith Jr. for Houston, that's gonna go to Dennis and the Rockets. We've got a Triple J to 100 for Memphis, that's gonna be for Dennis. Benedict Mathurian had a pretty good rookie season. That's for the Pacers. It's going to go to David B. You got a Patrick Baldwin Jr. purple to 75. That'll be another warrior for Fong. And the autograph is rookie auto uh, Malachi Branham.
That's our first auto. That's going to be for the Spurs. Jonathan Q with that one. Ever, you guys uh, and gals may have heard the phrase, rising tides lift all boats. I wonder if, uh, I mean, Spurs are going to take one Banyama, right? Here's Sadiq Bay to 75 for the Pistons, Scott. Does, uh, does Wen Banyama in San Antonio raise the stock of everybody else on that team, like Malachi Branham? Perhaps. Got Jared Allen to 150 for the Cavs. That'll be for Scott. Scott's leaning, uh, still leaning towards the Nuggets here. Yeah, the Nuggets are the heavy favorites, but I don't know. It's, you know, you kind of start second guessing yourself at times and you're thinking, man, everyone's counted out Miami since the beginning, yet all they've done this entire series is just win, win, win. No, I actually, in all seriousness, yeah, I'd probably just pass on the game. This might just be a, I, I, I don't do a lot of player props, but this could be a, could be a fun player prop sort of thing. Like, Another box. We got Frank Jackson to 150. We got a Paolo Bancaro, your rookie of the year. Base rookie card going to Orlando. That'll be for Brian. Brian C. Frank Jackson will go to Scott in Detroit. And behind Valanchunas is a Brooke Lopez. Fast break auto for Milwaukee. That's going to go to uh, Brian K. Brian C, Brian K, back to back. Valanchunas for Nancy and the Pels. It's to 100, Nancy, 45 out of 100. Got Rudy Gay. To 100 for the Jazz. That'll be for David B. Got a nice uh, Chet Holmgren base rookie card for OKC. That's going to be for Brian K. Different Brian K. Brian with an I. Kordek. We've got Oshai Agbaji to 75 for David B and the Jazz. Got a Josh Richardson to 150 for the Spurs, and it'll be for Jonathan. And the next box. Yeah, what? What are you gonna do with, with Jokic? Bam out of buy on Jokic? I mean, no one's really slow. No one's gonna slow Jokic down. According to uh, ESPN staff writer Nick Friedel, the headline reads, the ESPN headline reads, uh, Heat need all five guys to guard Nikola Jokic. Slow nuggets. Yeah. 
In order to make two-time MVP's life on the floor more difficult, Heat star Jimmy Butler and his teammates know they are going to need going to have to keep an eye on the big man everywhere he goes on the floor. Quote, guarding him as a team with all five guys, Butler said. He does everything so well, and we're going to have to be in the gaps. We're going to have to gang rebound. We can't have defensive lapses. We're just going to have to get after it. And I think at the end of the day, he's a major key. As DJ Khaled would say, we're going to have to lock in. Heat center Bam out of auto figures to, be, to get the majority of the time. Guarding Jokic. So yeah, so we'll see. So we shall see. Now, yeah, can they do it for a game or two? Absolutely. The Heat, but here's the next auto popping early. Cade Cunningham. Fast break autograph, Cade Cunningham. Second year Cade going to... Going to Scott in Detroit. There you go, Scott. Blue Davion Mitchell going to Sean Maddock in the Spurs. That's to 150. Dalen Terry to 100 for Chicago. That's also for Scott. Yeah, Yoke is still a couple inches taller, bigger wingspan. Yeah, he could just shoot over. He just shoots over everybody. Oh, nice Chet Holmgren, landscape mode. Fast break parallel. Brian Cordick with OKC, there you go. Danny Green, blue to 150. And Jaden Ivey for Detroit. Danny Green will go to Memphis. That'll be for Dennis. There's Aaron Gordon to 50. We'll see him in action tomorrow. Dennis has Denver. What a nice season for Hachimura when he got traded to the Lakers. It's Carmelo to 20, Lakers edition. Just retired recently. It's gonna go to Darren and my Lakers. All right, another box. Wonder how gassed the Miami Heat are, you know, playing an intense series. And then they gotta go to altitude, that's a real thing. Obviously Denver has had a lot of time off. And they're already used to the altitude, obviously. But what? How, how many days off did the Heat get? Just just a few. Save that. There's LaMelo Ball to 100. That's for Scott and Charlotte. Jalen Smith for the Pacers. Blue to 150 for David B.
We've got Duncan Robinson to 50. That's for Miami. Eric. Eric Wheel. Got Buddy Heald to 100 for the Pacers. It'll be for David B. And your auto behind Purple Sadiq Bay is gonna be is gonna be fast break autographs. Jawan Howard. Nice. That's for Scott and the Wizards. Old Jawan Howard. And there's Sadiq Bay to 75, Scott with the Pistons. Jawan Howard will certainly get a head coaching job someday in the NBA. I think there were some rumors he was going to leave this year, but um, but I want to say that he's got his two kids, or at least one or two of his kids are on that Michigan team that he's coaching. He probably wants to have the chance to coach his uh, to coach his kids before. He makes the turn into the NBA and give that a shot to see how that works out for him. We got Diabate, 13 out of 150 for the Clippers. We'll save that auto to the end of the break. And we got Santa Clara, Jalen Williams for Brian Kordak and OKC. Bruce Brown to 50. That'll be for Dennis in Denver. Cody Martin to 150. And prismatic LeBron James, that's gonna go to Darren and the Lakers. Cody Martin going to Scott and Charlotte. There's Red Jason Tatum, 26 out of 100. What do the What do the Celtics do? What can they do? I'm not entirely sure they can really do. You know, they, I mean, they're going to do whatever they can in the off season. They're, they'll, they'll have, I think, I think they should have draft picks. They'll try to make some deals, kind of. But the core of that team, I don't think it should change much. They got, they got to run it back. We got a rookie auto, Keegan Murray, yeah. Sean Maddock, and the Sacramento Kings. Kings had a really nice season. You know, if all this, and there's Bradley Beal for Scott and the Wizards. If all those young Kings players, if everybody takes just another step, another step forward in their player development, you know, another, another draft pick, another uh, off season, you know, retool some things here and there, keep improving.
Could be a it's a good looking team now. Could could be even better in the next season or two. If they're just if they're on schedule. Kings won, they were the three seed in the West. They had 48 wins. You're talking about the Celtics, Scott? Scott's saying, I think once this draft passes, they're eligible to trade their 2024 pick since they still have their own pick in 25 and 26. Yeah, Celtics. You got Malik Beasley to 75. And a nice Chet Holmgren right here. Just tuned in where the Celtics get. Nothing. Not at, nothing at the moment. We were just taught we were just chatting about the Celtics and seeing uh what, what they got to do in the off season to get to the next step, the next level. There's Wendell Moore Jr. to 150 and a Max Christie rookie silver. It'll be interesting to see if he Keeps taking steps forward, starts to get some more regular minutes next year. Darren with my Lakers. Here's the auto behind Dominique Wilkins for the Hawks. That's going to go to Ben. It's Tyree Eason, rookie auto for Houston. Dennis with the Rockets. That's to 100. Oh yeah, let's get that filler done. It's to 150, Carl Anthony Towns. Another Jalen Williams right here. And a Uzmai Dieng to 75 for the Clippers. I'm going to go to Scott in the clip show. game. You already saw this Dodger doc here. We watch some regional coverage on MLB Network. Oh, 10 free spots in there as well. That's a good deal. Wow, and Mark Kana just took Aaron Nola yard, two-run shot. What's happening in baseball today? Uh, the Nationals hit five homers to beat my Dodgers today, 10-6. to six. And I'm not sure how, how long Noah Syndergaard is going to be in this rotation. Pirates beat the Giants 9-4. Brian Reynolds driving in two runs to add to their lead. Ozzie Albies hit a two-run shot today. Braves beat the A's 4-2. to 
Josh Naylor with a six RBI game. Guardians beat the Orioles 12 to eight. Jose Siri puts the Rays up into eighth with a two run homer. They beat the Cubs four to three. Otani, two homer day for Otani. I think Trout had a homer too. They beat the White Sox 12 to five. And in his Tigers debut, Jake Marisnik drives into key run. Tigers beat the Rangers three to two. And there's some games in progress we'll just check in on in the next box. Here's the next one right there. Let's hide the auto. Let's try to save that to the end. Got Victor Oladipo to 100. That'll be for Eric in Miami. Brandon Clark to 50 for Memphis. Dennis. Jaden Ivey, Jabari Smith Jr., both in the that fast break parallel there. Dalen Terry to 150. Dalen is for Scott and Chicago. Dennis has the Rockets. And Scott also has Detroit. We got Anthony Simons for the Trailblazers, 420. Dennis with Portland. Yeah, um, keep me posted on on Justin Steele, Rex, because he's on my fantasy team. Is Eric Gordon to 150. I don't like what they were saying. Never, never want to hear about forearm tightness and shoulder pain. I think an IL stint is probably probably definite, but hopefully it won't be that long. The autograph is rookie auto Trevor Keels. Fast break autograph, a rookie. Knicks, Scott with the Knicks. All right, another box. Got some games in progress. Top of the sixth, Padres up one nothing on the fish. Middle of the third, Brewers at Blue Jays. Brewers up two nothing. Cincinnati's in Boston. Bottom of the third, Red Sox are up one nothing. And uh, the game that's on the background in my TV right now. Phillies at Mets. We just saw the Mark Cano home run, putting the Mets up 2-1 in the bottom of the third. Dodgers wasted a two-homer effort by Mookie Betts today. Uh, Alec Baum apparently out again with hamstring tightness. We got Duncan Robinson to 50 for the Miami Heat, Eric. And Duncan Robinson again, his autograph this time. We'll see how he does in the final. I wonder what the odds are on Duncan Robinson NBA Finals MVP.
According to ESPN and whatever book they use, Caesars maybe, Duncan Robinson isn't even offered on there. Nikola Jokic is the obvious one, minus 330. That's crazy. Jimmy Butler, plus 340. Jamal Murray, plus 800. Then it jumps to Bam Adebayo, plus 4,000, 40 to 1. Caleb Martin, 45 to 1. Michael Porter Jr., 100 to 1. Aaron Gordon, 200 to 1. It's Jeremy Sohan to 150. He had a nice season for the Spurs. Jonathan. To Paolo Bancaro in the uh, landscape mode. Orlando. Brian C. with that one. Your reigning rookie of the year. Dorian Finney-Smith to 100 for Dallas. That'll be for Brian H. Another Paolo Bank here. We got a lot of Brian's in this break. Brian H. Brian with a Y. Brian K with a Y. <laughs> Brian K with an I. And a Brian C. Davion Mitchell for the Kings to 150. Seth Curry for the Nets to 75. That'll be for James, Brooklyn. All right, a couple boxes to go. I'm not very good with uh, with these these award type type wagers, but too easy to take the favorites. I wonder who would be a good. Uh, I think Jamal Murray at plus eight hundred, eight to one. Maybe the Miami Heat do slow down Nikola Jokic. But if Jamal Murray feasts. Be a great comeback story. From injury, what, what was it, an ACL or Achilles or something like that? From From an injury, his way back, MVP finals, finals MVP. There's Amari Stoudemire to 100 for Phoenix. That'll be for Patrick. Got a Jaden Ivey in landscape mode for the Pistons. That'll be for Scott. Yeah. Got Buddy Heald to 75 for Indiana. That's going to go to David B. We got John Morant Blue and for the Jazz, John Stockton. David B with the Jazz. I feel like the uh, the short shorts are coming back a little bit here.
There's Benic Mathurian, blue, to 150 for David B. and the Pacers. Had a real solid season. Lori Markinen, 10 out of 50. For the Jazz, that's for David B. All right, final box coming up. We've got a lot of orders coming through, so let's see. Uh, let's see what we're going to get into. All right, good luck, gang. Thank you once again for the fill. Is it the autograph popping early? No, it's not. There's the auto right there. We'll save that. Got Luka Doncic blue to 150 for Dallas. That's for Brian H. Carmelo, pink to 50. That's for, that's for my Lakers. Darren with my Lakers. Got Jeff Green to 75 for Denver. That'll be for Dennis and Denver. Last little stack, then the auto, and I'll do a quick little recap too. Tyrese Martin uh, to 75 for Atlanta. That'll be for Ben. And the autograph behind Blue Obi Toppin for the Knicks, that's gonna be for Scott, is Colin Sexton for the Utah Jazz. Fast break autographs for David B. and Utah. Not a bad break, ladies and gentlemen. Second half in the store right now, jazbeescasebreaks.com. I think that's the only fast break case we have in the shop. So let's finish it out. Let's give away the wax party invite first. And then I'll do a recap. So let's flip back to the list. Good luck, everybody. Let's gather everybody's names, one through 30. New dice, new list. And uh, 29 sad spots, one happy spot on top after three. Good luck. One, two, and three. Fingers crossed, everybody. A lot of sad faces here, but remember, there's tons of invites remaining. We're keeping track of that on Jaspi's, uh, our break schedule. So click that break schedule, click the Wax Party tab, and you'll be able to see, um, you'll be able to see all, the in, all the winners, all the invitees, and how many are left. All right, Sean Maddock, sorry, <laughs> very close, but not quite this time. But like I was saying, a lot of opportunities for you and everyone. Thanks everybody for trying, two through 30, thank you very much. But only one happy person, and that's gonna be Brian Heyman. There you go, Brian. Congrats to you. After three, you've got an invite to the wax party, and hopefully you'll win some nice wax. You're already guaranteed something, but hopefully it'll be a nice something. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break.